Hello friends, welcome back to another episode of Wasteland 3. And we are underneath the bazaar and we seem to have found ourselves a whole lot of bad, bad clowns. Oh, we're going to do what we do when we find ourselves some bad clowns. And we're going to take them out. Is that's what we do here. It's F you clown. Are we gonna prepare for next round here with ice? Valkyrie. Do we wanna move all the way up? Let's see, it's four. Can we do anything with one? No. So it's only one to get two attacks. So we're going to move up and just go with the single. We got a torrent strike here. That was effective. <laughs> so Chuckles over here got, uh, got himself some serious armor. So we've got a Trickster, Chuckles, and we got the good hit chance, we just not, not the good damage, and we're going to defend that. Cobra! Alright, we're going to come all the way over here. We're not going to be able to hit anybody. We'll take some defense here. Venom. She's stuck all the way in the back. Then you're going to prepare for next turn here. I want to make sure she's got enough movement to be able to get online. And I believe a precision strike against Lieutenant Chuckles here is a good idea. Now, we could go for the flame tank with a one-third chance of blowing him up completely. Or we go with the body and reduce his armor so that everybody else has better damage against him. I think we're going to go flame tank. Let's take the risk. Not, no good. Let's defend. All right, Lucia. Let's get over here and let's get in on the bastard. Nice shot. Okay, so they're going for demoralize. More demoralize. And he's going to light up the porkers. Ooh, and he toasted that barrel. And she's chilled. Lucia gonna be on the ground. Alright, we are going to go with the body this time. Destroy his armor. We got another shot on him, too. Nice. Solid. Valkyrie. Let's move it up this way. I know we're out in the open, but let's take care of the lieutenant. And since we're out in the open, we're going to defend that. Cobra. Yeah, let's go for it. Big hit. Huge hit right there. Gotta love it. Let's defend. Venom. We only got a 48% here. Or do we pick up Lucia? Oh, she's got 
Ah, lame leg. Stick with me and maybe I'll live. Now Lucia's shell shot. Let's defend here. Lucia can med. And Marshall Kwan. I think this is the spot we want to be. All right, nice. Next turn. Okay, demoralize. Yeah, you keep going on with that. That was savage. All right, ice. Big snipe? Come on, big snipe. Nice! Valkyrie! I like this spot here. And we're going go against the bastard, take him out. And Cobra for the trickster. Nice. Picking a winner. All right. Loot. Let's see. We got wigs, junk, junk. Ooh, bacon. Got an Uzi, some ammo. More junk. What's it? Scout helmets. Ooh, hit chance, perception, armor. That's nice. Meds. Meds are always good, never bad. And we've got a level up on Valkyrie. Coordination. Let's go for intelligence here. And then go for the skills. Mechanics. Hard ass. First animal whisper. I think we're going mechanics here. And confirm that. Yep, yeah, we've got a level up here on our boy Ice. Let's go with another point of intelligence here. Skills. Now we were holding that. Oh, we got seven. Yeah, we want lockpick. We're going to take lockpick and we're going to take sneaky shit too. Let's check the perks. What have we got? So nerd stuff. We got the hacked robots, concentration. That's, that looks nice. Sneaky shit. Uh, detection time, plus one seconds. This is, uh, this is good. We're gonna take, uh, we're gonna take that. And Mr. Quan. Quan, intelligence coordination. I think we're gonna take some coordination here. Let's get some more action points. Quan for sneaky shit. Yeah, sounds good. I like it. All right. Now Lucia has shell shock. We got to fix that. We definitely have to fix that. I think we're going to go... Yeah, I'm squirreling a little bit, folks. Uh, so we're down on crit chance, but everything else goes up. Except armor. I think this is modded. Well, it's plus one armor and crit resistance. I think we're going to go with that. I, I like this idea better. All right, so Quan, you need meds. Lucia needs an injury kit. And I think we got to get an injury kit on Venom as well. All right, let's go. Let's go, let's go, let's go. 
All right. So what do we have laying around? We have the El Puerco. Ooh, use the key. Oh, what do we got here? Buried items. Open it up. Money and junk. Drug stash. Okay. Let's pick it. Go on, buddy. Pick a winner. Frostbite Revolver. Make sure you prepare a selection of cult team puns before taking this into a gunfight. Good against humans. And organics, not good against anything else. So let's see, it's energy cells, less ammo, less hit chance, less crit damage, more, much more penetration. And it's good against humans. It's kind of good. Let's drop that in the second slot. And it gives us, at least gives us something that we can um, mess around with. And we always have the option of, hey, corpse, junk, nice, large container. What do you got? Plasma linkage converts to energy damage. Cool. Road sign cleaver. Plasma. So we got some mods, some ammo, some weapons. Not bad. Mining mallets. And we're definitely not worried too much about that. Uh, we got an alarm on this. What else we got? Open the door. I guess this was another way in. So let's let's keep exploring this room we're in. Med crate. Okay, looks good. Monster army corpses. Okay, looks like they've been chewed on by pigs. I guess those aren't nice piggies. All right, a lot of junk. Now this is how we came in. Check that out. All right, we got a cup. We got a lockpick door over here. Another lockpick door over here. This one's open. I think we've, yeah, we've been in here before. This is actually back at the beginning. So let's look through. Uh, can we get our lockpick boy over here? Uh, door, please. Thank you. Hey. Uh, so yeah, that's, um, cool, man. Punk Buster shotgun. Yeah, extended mag, nice. And more armor mods. Oh, there's a we missed a container back here. We're gonna have to check out that shotgun, see if it's better than the one we have. Payaso's mission, a hog mask. Damage versus animals. Okay. Some of you pendejos keep asking me. What the fuck are we doing in this shithole? It's simple. See, we're uh, gonna disrupt the market. Yeah, the whole market with uh, the great joke. <laughs> you know, uh, bring this fucking place to a standstill. Gonna teach these cabrones how to laugh if we gotta kill them all to do it. We'll be treated as liberators. What I'm saying is we gotta destroy the bazaar in order to save it. Now, get the fuck out of here. I need some executive time with Senorita Puerca. Well, somebody's got very little taste. All right. 
Is it better? No. The last call is absolutely better. Gotta remember single shot on that thing. And yeah, definitely the dental pick is the way to go here. Now we had another door over here. Yeah. Let's go all sneaky shit here. Alright, good. So what's down this way? Alright, more junk. We got a container with more stuff. All right, we want ice in the front. So what's the computer got for us? On the monitor, the following words appear. Payasos only, coleros. If you can't finish the limerick, you don't get through the door. Comprende? First line's free. You pendejos all want us to croak. Now type in the next one. Uh, okay. We've got, uh, we're the punchline to every joke. So far, so good, puto. What's next? You pendejos all want us to croak. We're the punchline to every joke. Um, yeah, but El Payaso Mayor, halfway there, fucker, now what? We'll even the score. Now finish it, motherfucker. You pendejos all want us to croak. We're the punchline to every joke. But El Payaso Mayor will even the score. Uh, oh. And steal all your shit till you're broke. Uh, shit down your throat till you choke. Yeah, there we go. Hey, we had a, you know, 30% chance. El Payaso Rojo's return Hello. Is nigh. The Grand Carnival will consume all. Ready your paints, prepare your acids, gather all ye of shoes floppy and noses red. Ah, shut up, man. <laughs> Had enough of his mouth. All right. Everybody's ready. Muhammad? All right, it's not... Okay, we just have to straight up end the turn because none of them have AP. Just let us get in there. All right, let's see what we can do. Oh, it's that great germ guy, the little little croak smoker. So, what do we got going on here? This one actually... I think this one is on fire. We definitely gotta get him going. Nice! Provost! Alright, let's go for the fuego. See if we can't blow up his flame tank. Nope. And this is going to be... A reserve. Ooh, we can try to charm the hot hog here. Or we can just kill it. I think that's our play there. Yeah, we're not seeing him. Oh, we can see you all right, though. 
this is a possible kill here. We take this one. Yep, he's down. Let's defend that. And yeah, here we go. Big hit. Big hits. Let's defend that. This guy's almost done. You know, I don't like this. I want to go single shot here. Yeah, that was, um, that was kind of bad. Not going to lie. Yeah, Lucia's down. Do we do we pick up Lucia here? Yeah, I think we pick up Lucia here. Yeah, this is only self-targeting. Dang it, we didn't want to do that, but we're going to defend it. Lucia gets a heal. Okay, she's got internal bleeding, which... Okay, it's minus, just minus max con there. Heal me! I got teeth for the kill! Oh, we may lose our waste wolf. Yeah, we just lost the wolf. Oh, no, and Cobra's down. Not gonna lie, we kind of screwed that up. Like, a lot. because it looks like just about everybody's down right now. All right, let's revive Venom. And we still get some shots out. Nice, there goes the Fuego. And we're going to defend. Let's get a heal. And let's get up Valkyrie here. And Lucia. No, we don't have enough for it? Okay. We got nothing on him. Not enough there, but let's defend. And... Valkyrie. She's gonna... Is she gonna med dart herself? Yep. Get a little heal going on. And let's end the turn here. Yeah, demoralize Polly. Please. Ooh, I don't like that. Alright, let's get a turret out. <laughs> this is going all kinds of bad right now. Alright, let's heal... Bring up Lucia here. And let's bring up Ice here. And then we're going to go with... Absolutely nothing. We're going to defend this. 
Quan gets a heal. And then uh, Quan gets a grenade. And then Quan gets behind cover. And Venom gets a heal. And is then going to move over here and shoot both of these guys and miss completely. Ice, heal, and end turn. I'm kind of okay with him keep keeping on doing that. I mean, perfectly fine with that. And there goes Polly. Oh, poor Polly's dead. And Valkyrie's down again. We got 734, we got 33 here. This is the only guy we really have a chance to shoot. We're gonna heal. And we're gonna pick up Valkyrie. And that's, uh, okay, we're out. Okay, so this is heal on ourself. Let's shoot this. Let's reload. Let's go for a shredder shot here. There's some bleeding. I guess we're going for the Great Gurn. And not really doing much there. Can we get one lucky shot? Nope. Not at all. End the turn. Cobra's gonna die. And here comes another Puerco. <laughs> wow. This is going all kinds of bad, folks. Let's get a heal. And that's all misses. Okay, fine, let's do it this way. And we're gonna go pick up Valkyrie. And defend. Alright, let's move over here with Lucia, see if we can't get something done against uh, the Great Gurn. Or not. So let's defend that. Heal, please. There we go. I don't think we're getting out of this one, folks.
Defend it. And the turn. Here comes the pig. Yep. <laughs> Provost got him. Alright, there goes Lucia. Everybody's dead. So let's reload it. All right, so it's backing us up right here. So we've got our whole crew here. Now the question is, do we go for the pigs? Tricksters, they're, they're a big problem with the smoke grenades. They keep you from being able to hit anybody. I mean, the bastards are annoying. Now let's work on taking down the tricksters. Alright, let's run over this side and we're going to defend. Who's in the front? Marshal Kwan. Slide over to the right side and let's try to take out this guy. No dice. How about Lucia? We got 33%. Nope. Venom will move over here and will ambush. Valkyrie's going to try to finish off this guy. There we go. He's down. Perfect. And we can get in here and get some shots out with the heavy machine gun also. 53% here? Actually, it's a, it's not a bad hit chance. You're out of range. You're 37. Only 13 there. But we're going to go with this guy here, the 53%, and go for the chance to actually get a kill on him. Alright, and the turn. Now we need to get a... That worked. We need, definitely need to get a turret out. I want to be able to distract the uh, the hot hogs. All right, there's the concealing.
They're taking damage, which is good. There's the earth-shattering kaboom. Provost coming in. All right. Let's go for the flame tank on the Fuego. No dice. Let's prepare this. Now we need a turret. Let's get a turret out right there. Now we can't see you. And we don't have a lot of AP right now. I think what we want to do is we're going to move over here and we're going to reserve it. This is all about using the wrong weapon. Defend it. Now what we're not going to do here... Unfortunately we don't have a double hit chance here. Now we do. Can we get all... Oh, oh, uh, we'll get, catch the machine turret here, but I'm okay with that. Let's get some defense going. Now, Quan. Let's see, we got a Bastard, we got the Fuego. These are the guys that can really screw us up because of the, uh, the Hot Hogs. Let's get in up here. And we'll go against this guy. Nice crits. All right. Let's get a hypo. Get a little healing going on. Now, can we get... No. We don't have enough range to pull off a grenade here. All right, let's go ambush and end the turn. Oh, that's going to hurt. She's down. We need some heals on Cobra, too. Provost, nice hit. Nice hit. Let's see, where's our big shots? 95% here. This is also a kill. And then we got this guy with a miss. Let's go. Let's try to light him up. Nice crits there. Let's save it for later. We need a heal. And then we need to smack this guy with a big old dental pick. Now let's defend. We can go after this guy. We got 68% on the trickster over here, too. And we can shoot him twice. Nice, and he's down. There we go. Now let's get defense here. Lucia? Out of range. Just out of range. Move around the corner here. We're concealed, which is nice. Solid shots. And we've got our strike meter up now. 
Let's get some defense and end the turn. Oh, the turret doesn't quite get the bastard down. And we got another flaming hog. are you going to get? Now, we definitely don't want to go for the flame tank on this guy now. That's for sure. Waste Wolf did some bits there. Alright, can we get him? Let's get a reload. And we're going to finish up our turn completely. You're down. You're out of range. We get up here. Let's pick up Venom. And defend. Let's get a heal. We can't get a hit here, but we can get one here. I like this. Oh, I don't like that. Right here for Marshall Quan. Sounds good. There we go. Defend. She can hit him. Or we can go for this guy. I kind of like that idea better. Let's go here. Let's go body. And he's almost dead. Our, uh, our buddy should be able to finish him off. Barbecued, you barbecued Polly! How dare you! <laughs> Venom's on the ground again. Turrets down. All right, nice hits. Waste Wolf kicking out some terrified. Get it out. Nice critical right there. Prepare that. Now we can go with this guy. Big hits. Perfect, perfect. Gotta love it. All right. Well, this time we got through it. All right, heals for Lucia. We're, uh, no, 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 not that one. Not quite fast enough. All right, we need to get... Let's get the med kits here so you can use those on the waste wolf heal that up and where's Polly did Polly buy the farm Possible. I think we might have lost Polly. 
I don't know if Lost Polly is the... Uh, most accurate way to call it. Everybody gets heals. And Lucia's got a level up. Ah, more intelligence. I like it. Do we want more barter? No, we want more small arms. Yeah, we want more small arms here. And she's the only one with the level up right now, so that's... Okay. Uh, let's get some loot. Junk. Junk and ammo, junk and ammo. Nice to see the injury kits. More ammo. Did so, go, go, safe key. Okay, picture of a clown. Okay, yeah. Yeah, it looks like Polly did die. Um, oh well. <laughs> Let's go see what's up in here. Alright, we got a safe. Storage unit 107. Decoy. Clown horn. Ammo. Mods. Not bad. Not bad at all. Alright, med darts. Ammo box. Nice, nice. Alright, let's... Statue of Jesus has been adorned with clown garments and makeup. That's... That's kind of disrespectful, you know, not going to lie. I mean... Wow. Clown's got no respect for anybody. Alright, let's get out of here. Let's check out the map. Alright, so that's Bizarre Exterior. This was the chapel, prison block. So we've got this way we can go. And that way we can go. So let's check over here. Because this looks like it's more of this area. Loot. Ooh, nice weapon mod. That was, that's a nice one, too. Flat plus four damage. Not gonna lie, good stuff. Suture kit. Nothing else back in here. All right. Well, I guess we need to go this way. All right. Do we see anything through here? Waste Wormling. Target acquired. Did we seriously just mess that? All right. <laughs> oh, hello, and poison now. I think ending our turn was the wrong move. Lucia, you're going to pick up Valkyrie here. Mm. 
nice shot. Nice shot again. All right. All right. Loot. Dragon ornament. Cool. Alright. Heal. Uh, do we have an antidote? Yep. Use it. Yeah, let's eat the bacon. And let's eat the bacon. Okay, that's everybody. Got a pile of junk here. And some mods. All right, hey. Oh, we got Picklock. Frank E. Steen. All right, we got an ammo box here, and we got a truck. Let's see what's in this thing. Money and junk. All right, let's go. Uh, let's go talk to Frankie. Stop! Where the fuck did you come from? You can't come in here. Oh yeah. We have an entrance pass. All right, so you do, but I didn't see you go in. What the hell were you doing in the Warrens, man? Uh, taking a look around, we found another entrance. Finding a bunch of lunatics dressed up as clowns. clowns. Fuck! So I'm not going insane. That's good. We've been hearing laughter and giggling coming from the Warrens, and people keep disappearing. Our boss Flab's gonna want to hear about this. You guys can find him upstairs. All right. Head upstairs and talk to Flab. He'll make it worth your while. Uh, we got some pigs over here. Let's see what's over in here. Oh, boost box. Boost box. Loot it. DJ Rip. What do you got, man? Hey, hey, hey! Welcome to the house of DJ R.I.P. I take it you're here for the giveaway contest. Um, yes. All right, all right, all right. We're live in three, two. All right, everybody! It's time for another round of DJ R.I.P.'s Believe It or Not. We have some new faces for you today. Hey, introduce yourselves to our audience. Uh, yeah, we're the Rangers. The Rangers of Colorado! Get ready for the question, but first, a quick shout out to today's sponsor, the fabulous Chick Flicks Theater. Come see their shows, come again, then leave satisfied. Now, your question. In the year 1984, a giant marshmallow man attacked the city of New York. Believe it or not. Well, it was a great movie, but not... Correct. The giant marshmallow man was fictional, folks. No matter how many times he pops from the movies into my nightmares. <laughs> <laughs> Stay puffed. Anyway, here is your reward, fine folks. And for our listeners, A Sonic this Emitter. For all you and some out money. There. Nice. Let's see, who are you? DJ R.I.P. in the house. Uh, basement. I'm the Bazaar's resident jockeyer of discs and spinner of plates, here to entertain the masses. Okay, why are you down Just here? I my booth up above, but they told me my sounds were bothering the fine folks doing their shopping. No skin off my teeth there. As long as I have my music, I'm fine wherever. Uh, tell us about this place. Everything's been peachy keen since you took care of whatever was haunting the Warrens. Good job. All right, uh, later. All right. All right, sounds good. Let's see, there's the provost. Who are you? Hey there. Always good to see some friendly Wind faces plane. down here. Don't go near the cages, though. The little piggies are friendly, but they'll bite if they get spooked. Oh, okay. don't mind the smell. Nothing some fragrant flower beds wouldn't fix. 
Only thing is, we ain't got any of those down here in the Warrens. <laughs> okay. Uh, I tell you what, we found some perfume. You can soak a rag in it, put it over your nose, and you won't smell pig shit anymore. There you go. pig balls, you're a lifesaver. Yes, absolutely, I'll take that off your hands. And here's a little something for your troubles. You come back anytime now, okay, friends? All right, so we got a liver box. Uh, holy shit, it smells I in here. I smell nothing but the sweet scent of daisies and daffodils. And pig shit. Uh, tell us about the Think warrants. Think of it as snow tunnels dug out by the monster army ages ago. They're safe again now, thanks to you. All right, uh, you take care of the pigs? Yep. Pigs have been a part of the monster army in the bazaar as long as it's been around. Not a common good out here, you see. Highly valued. So we keep them well fed, happy, and guarded. Okay, so what's with the outfit? This, the traditional garb of the monster army tenders. Our job is to tend to our piggies, as well as do any maintenance needed to keep this place up. Okay. All right, later. Now come back now. All right. So we have nothing else here? Oh, oh what? what? Medical supplies. Supplies! Injury kit. Nice. Alright, um. I, th I don't think she's gonna let us, uh. through those doors. She's talking about, uh. everybody. Uh, guys, hello. Let's go. Let, oh, let's get inside the bazaar. What do we have here? So we got to find out uh, what the good stuff is. Who's got the goods? All right, we got a monster army tender. I guess that's the way. Yep, that's probably the way out. Mall directory. The sign reads Erectory and Shop Die Play. <laughs> All right. Guns sanctified with blood, blood sanctified. By okay. Guns. You're a Some bright light. Gun or assault rifle. I can't decide. You hear the stories assault about light. the killer clown? No uh, they they say hours. he eats kids. My feet are killing me. All right, so we got Gwyn Talbot also. Talk to our boss if you're here to help. I can't believe we missed. Yes, sir, These are perfect. Here, here. But they're too small. Bartender Finn Masato. Oh, hey, Doc. Why, hello. Name's Hirsch. Lev Hirsch. But you can just call me Jack Cold Cut. <laughs> what do you need? Uh, let's see. Can you patch us up? Yeah, pig. Human <laughs> ain't so different. <laughs> Cash first, and I'll fix you right up. All right, that'll that'll help. Eight days. <laughs> this won't hurt a bit. We got a lot of injuries going on. I'll save us some injury kits and stuff. Why is your name Cold Cuts? Oh, it used to be the veterinarian slash butcher here back in the day. Learned all about how the body works by carving up meat, uh, animal meat, uh, of course. When Doc Kessler passed, well, I uh, inherited the position. Okay, tell us about uh, bizarre. Not much. Got all kinds of traders here, selling all sorts of junk. <laughs> the heart of this place is meat, though. Pig meat is a luxury not everyone can afford. Anyway, okay. got a bit of a pickle of late. Something murderous roaming the Warrens. Some say it's the old monster army leader. The Cyclops come back from the dead and hunting us. Bunch of BS if you ask me, but something's down there. Talk to Flab if you haven't already. I guess Flab is the guy we gotta talk to. What about ah, medical supplies? Self-medicating sort. Sure, take a look. What do you got? What do you got? What do you got? All right, injury kits. Let's sell the junk first. Nice. Got ourselves in a good way now. All right, let's see. We want... Usable. I, oh. All right, so we've got a few med packs, hypos... Injury kits, kind of all right. I think we're going to get uh, a couple of nitro spikes, though. Just so we can get the revives going. Uh, 
Uh, let's get the med hypos. Oh, we should be good now. Oh, there's Flab. Yeah, um, listen, we're gonna pick your, uh... Stay away from that safe, Lambs. Come on, man. All right, Flab. Children of the desert. What wonderful music they make. What do you want of Jacob the Magnificent? This wonderful, wonderful... The corpulent man standing before you spits out a set of fake Dracula teeth and wipes his mouth. Let's never mind with the acts, shall we? You are the Brangers, yes? Welcome to the bazaar, where my hospitality is law. You do not find us at the best of times. Uh, what's with the Dracula act? Do not judge harshly, my friends. We hold on to our rituals of the past to try to remember our long lost strength. It may strike you as pathetic, but it gives us much needed comfort. Okay. Now, uh, what do you mean, not the best you of times? I have not noticed. I am surprised, but nonetheless. We have been under assault, my friends. Really? Something, someone, some horrible unknown thing is roaming the warrens below us. People have been disappearing. Not to mention the pigs loaded with explosives running amok. So what? You are the Patriarch's Rangers, yes? If he trusts you, so can I. Nothing we've done has helped, so your arrival could not be more fortuitous. We need your help to combat this threat. Okay. Uh, let's see. How long has this been uh, down below us? Yeah, we found some crazy clowns down there. Yeah, we wiped them out already. Really? <gasps> I'm impressed by your initiative. Clowns, you say? This could only have been... Los payasos, they are monsters without conscience, with no respect for human life or dignity. Yeah, you got that right. Friends, the bazaar is indebted to you. All our stores are open to you at a discount. And oh, nice. Here, take this as a token of my thanks. All right, uh, let's talk to Flab again. I welcome you to my house. Make yourself comfortable. My hospitality is law here. All right, let's tell us some more about you. You ask too much of me, my friends. What is a leader but a servant of the community? My story is the bizarre story. I am nothing but a receptacle of its wishes. Okay. Uh, let's see. Probably isn't very sensitive to ask, but let, should we ask him about his nickname? Yeah, let's ask him about his nickname. I appreciate the delicacy. Your compassion will be remembered. But no, I've no thoughts on the nickname they have given to me, and no cause to think about it. After all, Flab describes me well, does it not? Uh, yeah, I suppose so. Good. Most would have lied to my face. Told me that Flab the Inhaler was a blasphemy against my greatness. <laughs> but you... Well, you he's definitely got courage. greatness. Greatness of waste. I see a long friendship ahead of us. The truth is that I see this fat as proof of my station in life. Here, in these wastelands, how many have the opportunity to eat and flourish as I have? I got a point. Uh, let's see. How did you end up in charge of the bazaar? We have other questions. And yeah. I would be a bad host if I did not provide you with answers. 
Okay, uh, tell us about the bazaar. Well, yeah, yeah, tell us a little about the bazaar. Decadent oasis steeped in culinary wonders. The bazaar is Colorado's gastronomic holy land. It is a carnival of wonders. It is paradise. But it was even more splendid once, a long time ago. All right. Um. Yeah. Let's go. Let's go look around. We'll be waiting. If you're looking for guns, the sanctified Piscatelli has the best. All right. Boxes, boxes, I got the box. Get your protective gear here. Wish they served chicken here. Hot noodles. Noodles, huh? Let's talk noodles. The man before you is moving so fast he is nearly a blur as he dashes from pot to pot on his stove, stirring one, tasting another. As you approach, he stops his cooking to turn his undivided attention to you. Hello, hello there, my friends. My name is Masato, and let me tell you, your taste buds will remember the day you met me. Here, have you ever seen anything this delicious? He holds a steaming hot bowl in front of you, filled to the brim with some kind of noodles. Uh, yes, that looks amazing, may we? Yes, yes. Be my guest. After enjoying this bowl, know that my store is open to you. I have a variety of goods that you may find useful. He hands you the bowl, which turns out to be a mix of noodles and pork, which is filling and quite delicious. He watches you eat it with a hopeful a grin. A man who never eats pork is never a whole man. But I have to tell you, my friends, these noodles are a pale imitation of the real thing. The great pre-war delicacy. The rarest of rare magics. Instant ramen noodles. I hope wow. one day I will perfect my recipe to recreate them. But enough about me. How can I be of service? Uh, you're looking for instant ramen. We're looking for a caravan master ranger. Eight. Oh. Ah, you picked up yes. on my subtle hints. Years ago, a friend in Colorado Springs gave me a package of instant ramen noodles that he had found in the Warrens underneath the bazaar. The experience changed my life forever, and I moved here in hopes of finding more. Ah. The cook starts to fidget, despair painting his face as he loses his usual buoyant composure. Please, you must understand. It is as if my body is made of ramen. <laughs> you have been to the Warrens, yes? Did you see any vending machines? I've heard they may hold this delicacy. Please, let me know if you find any. Uh, here. Yes, yes, my friend. You don't know what this means to me. You have altered the course of human Ooh, gastronomical history. Here, a small measure of my gratitude. Ooh, and some money. Yeah, we're looking for a caravan Paradolia master. Paradolia Jones is the only caravan master here. But as luck would have it, he's also one of our best. He's right over there. I guess this is him. Masato indicates a man in a cowboy outfit standing near the fountain edge. Let's see, Ranger HQ could use a chef like you. Oh, how interesting. You mean a permanent position? A full kitchen of my own? My, my friends, that is quite the offer you're making me. Thanks to you, I've accomplished my goal here. So I am more than ready for my next adventure. Let me pack up my supplies here, and I'll see you at your HQ. Cool. Uh, let's see... Can you tell us about the bazaar's residence? Idolon is relatively new to this place. She showed up not long after I did. Her business model is interesting. Not sure how she actually makes money, though. Uh, let's see. Do we want to gossip more? See the wares? No, let's just... See you at Ranger HQ. Let's see. Uh, yep, Paradolia Jones. Let's talk to him. All right, as you approach, this man's eyes flit over every member of your team as if assessing whether or not you are a direct threat. He relaxes after a moment and touches the brim of his hat with a slight Howdy, nod. He nods at Lucia. Howdy. Always good to see you, Wesson. He turns to you, nodding again. Let's see. Um, we could use your help. There's a group of refugees topside in your transport to Colorado Springs. Not my usual line of business, but I don't see why not. My normal rates would apply for a one-way transport. Let's see. Um, here's the money to transport the refugees. That way we can just give them the money. Uh, we can do kiss-ass or barter. 
Um, let's go kiss okay. ass. Okay, I hear you. No need to make a man feel bad about trying to earn a living. All right, I'll make sure they're in my next caravan run to Colorado Springs. I'll send people to check on them now. Okay, right, that works. Uh, do you have anything for sale? Just my services as a caravan master. I organize caravans to get people, goods, and livestock from one place to another. But I don't sell goods myself. These lands near Colorado Springs are pretty safe. But still lots of people need help getting around. Especially if you want to range further than that. Okay, can you tell us about Colorado? Next to the Patriarch, this stretch of land from Denver in the north to Steeltown in the south is pretty safe to travel. You'll find richer opportunities the further you venture out. But it'll also come with more risks. Mm, I could tell you more, but truth be told, the only way to know the land is to travel it. You look well equipped and competent. Just head out and see what you can learn. All right, so uh, we will bid him and everyone else adieu as we close it up for the day. Uh, when we come back, we'll take a look at uh, the gun shop. Maybe there's an armor shop. Seems like a place to buy and sell. So we'll have to look around and see what we can buy and sell. I hope everyone enjoyed it. If you did, don't forget the three S's. Smash it, sub it, and share it. Smash that like button. Subscribe for more content and share it with your friends. Thanks for stopping by and we'll see you in the next one. Have a great day, everybody.